Hello, I'm Dr. Ashik Saino. I'm a senior consultant gastroenterologist, hepatologist and therapeutic endoscopist. I head the Center of Excellence for Digestive Diseases at Aster Al Rafa Royal Hospital. At our unit, we receive a lot of requests from patients asking us to do IgG based, commercially available food allergy tests. We just wanted to tell you, we don't do that in our unit, basically because they've not been proven or are not backed by solid evidence from any of the nutritional agencies across the world to be effective or to add any clinical relevance in treating a patient with a potential food allergy. Food allergies are mostly driven by IgE mediated antibody responses or cell mediated responses. But most of uh, the symptoms which patients may feel also could be because of food intolerances. Just because your immunoglobulin levels to a food is positive in the tests which you have done does not mean that you have to avoid that food which is a common happening in most of the patients who are undergoing these tests they cut out a lot of food groups resulting in malnutrition and inadequate nutrition we do not suggest that neither do any of the international nutritional agencies Immuno if you have doubts about a real food allergy kindly meet your gi team or an allergy team to identify them properly through proper ige based or skin-based testing. Do not fall prey to immunoglobulin G-based testing for food allergies and cut out complete food groups resulting in problems. Thank you.